Hello VC. Six records have arrived in the last couple of weeks that I've added to my vinyl collection. So I'd like to show you what has arrived and hopefully you may discover a new band that you have not been aware of previously. I uh, might discover some new music that uh, interests you. So I'm going to start off with um, a record by the band The Third Sound. This is a Fuzz Club session. Uh, it is released as a uh, numbered copies. This is number 208 of 300. This is recorded live in a studio. Two records set. The record spin at 45 RPM. The third sound. As indicated on the jacket, uh, direct metal mastering. So I imagine they were going for an audiophile sound here. I discovered the third sound last year and they quickly become one of my favorite groups. If you've watched previous videos, I showed um, this album by the third sound late last year this would have definitely been in my top five purchases for 2022. And I expect that uh, the double uh, album set there that I just showed will probably be in my top five for 2023. It's a group really worth checking out. The next to arrive, again, this is new to me. I believe this is... Um, a UK group and I I have a feeling I'm not certain that this is um, like a repressing from a record that had been released uh, a number of years ago this is Lola Colt singer has a distinctive voice to me her voice would almost fit perfectly with a late 60s psych band or blue psych type band she has that type of voice very good uh, record worth checking out on YouTube see if you're interested the next uh, arrival is uh, album by broadcasts this is the bbc sessions from 1996 to 2003 this is a two record set
cover is very dark, I'm not sure how it would show up on the camera. There is a track listing and uh, some information on the back, but uh, it might be too dark to see. The music on this record, a few tracks remind me a little bit of like uh, sounding like Portishead. And also the vocalists on a couple tracks tend to remind me a little bit of Judy Cruz. Very interesting uh, record worth investigating to see if you uh, like that style of music and singing. The next two records are by the same artists, same band. It is, the artist is a, a place to bury strangers. The first I'm going to show is an EP called Hologram, consisting of five songs. The record spins at 45 RPM. This is a group I've been aware of for a while, but it's only recently that I've started buying some of their albums. I'll probably pick up a few more. Same group. This is, an, um, if I'm correct, an album that was um, released, um, I don't know, about 10, 12 years ago, perhaps. And this is, if I uh, understand correct, is a remastered a version. Uh, this is a fairly r recent uh, release, uh, remastered of, from the original. It is A Place to Bury Strangers, and the album is titled Exploding Head. familiar group worth checking out. The last album I'll show today, a little bit different from what I'm used to showing. I haven't, um, don't have too many records in my collection of this genre. Sort of uh, African music. This is uh, Fila and Roy Ayers. side consists of one song so you're basically the uh, entire side is one song this is a very high energy album 
This is uh, an album that will put the ants in your pants. If you can't be dancing to this, you must be dead. Great album. Worth checking out. Especially if you're interested in African music. So those are the records that I've added to my collection in the last couple of weeks. As always, thank you for watching and have a great day.